<laughs> I'm only going to ask you one more time, boy. Hand over my locket. I don't have your ugly locket. I've never seen it before. Hand it over or I'll slap the teeth out of your head. You're threatening the child. Don't you dare lay your finger on that child. All right, there. Show mate Yorkie here. Taking you back. Or Baldsgate 3. As little Oren goes big. Yes, our friendly orc prize fighter. I think that's what we'll call it. Um, Continues his journey. We found our Githyanki friend again. That's good. Taken on a temple. Met a leash who says he'll see us again later. Not sure I want to see him again later, but I guess we'll see what happens. Well, let's get back in there. Sent on sent. Really need somewhere that we can find to sell all the junk off as well. Right, we're down here at the moment, ancient ruins. We need to head up here. That's the cut marker. Overgrown ruins, ancient door. That's in there. All right, so let's. Swift as my feet can carry me. Let's head on up. Oh, that's not going to do us any good, is it? Let's not run through the fire if we can help it. I don't think we need to. Go around this way. We go. Around. Where were we off to? Oh, we do still need to go through there. Okay. Let's head this way. On we go, on we go. Ancient Sigil Circle. I don't think we've looked at that. What is it? That's... It does, doesn't it? You approach the sigil on the stone. Magic glitters and swirls from it erratically, as if malfunctioning. It looks slightly dangerous. That's less than me, then, lass. Uh, well, you know me. Always one for the fun and adventure. Let's touch it. Oh, that hurt. Hey, there's someone there. A hand? Anyone? Yeah, get the ass out here. Come on. Get out here. Ow. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Perhaps I should have clarified. Mm -hmm. A helping hand. <laughs> Anyone? <laughs> if I gave you a hand, I'll give you that much. All right, get out of here. Need seven, and I've got a plus here. I need four. Just did it. Well, that's our strong boy here. Rolled an eight. That's it. Go on. Keep pulling. Come on, you bugger. There we are. Oh. Hello. I'm Gale of Waterdeep. All right, cheery boy. Usually better at this. No need to apologize. You all right, mate? Shocked, but friend, it's a relief and a pleasure to make your acquaintance. I bet that didn't look Say, pleasant. I know you, don't I? In a manner of speaking, you were on the North Lloyd. Oh, you escaped from that bugger as well, did you? Yes, I was. I can only assume you two were on the receiving end of a rather 
unwelcome insertion in the eyeball. Yeah, I got a worm in the eyeball. No use sugarcoating it, is there? The insertee we speak of, this parasite, are you aware that after a period of excruciating gestation, it will turn us into mind flayers? Yep, this uh, gives Yankee about, he's about it, he's going to get us from it. And let me assure you, it is to be avoided. Yeah, I know that. This gives Yankee friends going to help us. By any chance, do you? No, but Shadow Heart is. Surgeon. Uncannily adroit with a knitting needle. You seem to know enough about our condition to realize it's beyond most cleric skills. Most, yeah, including us. No doubt, but I find myself hoping to be in the presence of the few. You don't happen to be one of them. No, she ain't good enough. Smelly enough, but she ain't good enough. Uh, can't say that I am. Oh, fighter. My hands are better suited to less delicate pursuits. I can offer you a swift end, but I can't cure you. As we've established, few enough can. It's not exactly a common affliction. We're most certainly going to need a healer, and soon too. How about we lend each other a helping hand once? Sounds good to me. For a healer. I really lent you one. Sounds like a plan. You're welcome to join me. I see you're traveling with plenty of company already. Perhaps I can join you later instead. Oh, I can only have four of you guys. Camp and embark upon a succulent slow cook to be consumed upon your return. Oh, can I only have four? Is that to do with uh, charisma? I wonder. No casting for bad pounding sorcerers and warlocks. Ooh. Intriguing. But really, I'm done with him, I think. But, never mind. Right, well, this is no more, is it? Oh, hang on. Oh, it's a waypoint. Oh, okay. There you go. I didn't even know that was a thing. Right, where are we? We're right here. We're heading back to this custom marker. So it looks like we're heading this way. Let's start by going here. I don't think there's anything up here to be uh, admired. We'll clear some of the fog of war. The foul. Chapel entrance. We go into the chapel and we're gonna get married. Well, probably not actually, but we're going to the chapel anyway, whether we're getting married or not. Ah, I see. Yeah, we went down here, didn't we? And then came out the other other door. Gotcha. Well, let's skip past it then. You will not even see it. What? See what? What are you going on about, Gitty friend? That might be worth a look. What might? Oh, a dirt mound. No hope of clearing this without a shovel. Yeah, well, such is life. Now we can climb down there. Let's do it. Hmm. What's down this hole? Ooh. But in a dank crypt. Oh, this is where we found already. Okay, nice. Get out of there. Well, I think we've finished the ruined chapel then. So, you know. Only if my people extract them. The only other cure is the blade. Okay. 
wonderful. Right, so where are we up to now? Going up that way. Alright, so first off, let's go around. Continue on. Two paths to choose from. One leads to certain death, one leads to life. Where are them bloody lying uh, guards that you can ask? Waypoint discovered. Emerald Grove one we're on. Okay, so that's down to the Emerald Grove, is it? Well, we ain't going that way, that's for sure. Hang on, we've got another uh, ancient signal. Oh, it's another waypoint. Okay, so we okay, so we can, uh, I guess, teleport or fast travel, whatever you call it, to the roadside cliffs overgrown ruins. Emerald Vale. Ah, nice. Okay. Balsam. That's uh, something we can gather. Ashes of Balsam. A recipe. Hey, we've got some people down here. Let's see what they need. Uh, this could be dangerous. We just had to auto-save. Open the bloody gate! Nobody gets in! Zevlor's orders! That pack of goblins will be on us any second! What's going on? Goblins are on our tail! Open the gate, Zevlor, now! You let goblins here? Where is the truth? <laughs> You're worried about some goblins? Come on! What's to worry about a few uh, greasy crop goblins? Oh, wait up. Well, that might be a bit of a worry, but we should be okay. By the nine hells! Open the gates! <coughs> Goblin archers! There you go. Well, he got it! Yeah, it's down! Oh, not quite! No trying! Nope! Yeah, it's down! Here come the gobbles! They have done. I mean, there's only three of you. It's not going to be much of a light. Hey, oh, nice. Oh, who's this guy? Provoke the blade. Nice. Can he join us? Oh, we only seem to be able to have uh, four people. Sounds like. Yes. He missed. Good. Well, he got hurt. Oh, did she? And now doggy's coming in. Let's see if we can uh, go range, shall we? You picked the wrong fight, friend. Hey, I managed to win him even at thirty percent. Nice. Another step forward. Oh, there's a bugger up here. Two buggers up here. Okay, nice to know. He's knocked down, but not permanently down. Nice. Can we have this guy on our side? Oh, yeah, bugger. He hit me! I'm gonna take his butt to the cleaners. Uh
Alright, you can stay there. Are you knocked down? Alright. You can come down here and... Guided Bolt Force 24, can you hit him? Nope. Alright, try a range shot. Yeah, hit! Nicely done. Then get further down. Not all that useful, eh? <laughs> yeah, they're getting a bit mangled up there. Ow! My turn. And we'll have our second... Oh, we can't have our second wind yet. Nice shot! Who is this guy? Get up there and fire. He's down. That's me, little Oren. Another down. Alright, you can't get far enough, so let's try and do him instead. Nice. Getting ready to fight. Don't be gonna get smacked. Not enough to hurt it properly, but it did get smacked. Oh, that's... What the hell, Will? Why'd you attack me? That was the last of them. Inside, all of you, more may follow. Open the gate! That looks like might be some improved bows here. Mm. 
another step forward. The bugger's dropped the gate on us! The bugger's! Oh, there they are. That's better. I was about to say. What's next? Well, what's next is we're going to have a look at the things we've picked up. What's this? Goblin bow, three to eight, compared to uh, that is three to ten. So it's not as good. And this is a Goblin Scimitar, 4 to 9 compared to 4 to 15, not as good. Morning Star, 4 to 11. What about our other people here? Oh, hang on. Before we do that, that's fine. I'm ready. You're doing 3 to 13. You. Uh, you have got to level up. Nice. Uh, fell, uh, High Elf Rogue gained two cantrips. Bone Chill 1v8, uh, Necrotic. Prevent the target from healing until your next turn. One day, target received disadvantage on attack rolls. That's nice damage. Poison Spray 1d12. Dancing Lights. Might be a nice utility to have. Friends, gain advantage on charisma checks. Blade Ward. Shocking Grasp. Ray of Frost. True Strike. Minor Illusion. Light. Take that out, put that in. Let's give friends. Two spells. Well, given you're a rogue, you probably should be charming people. Um, and... Tasha's Hideous Laughter. When extended, expanded. Burning hands, full of spray. Summon a familiar, a face spirit that takes an animal form of your choosing. Yeah, go on, you can have that. Give him a pet. Alright, so that's nice. Why are we... I'm experience 576, need 24. What's next, I wonder? 596, need 4. 576, need 24. Action, not reaction. 596, need 4. Okay. Actually, since we're inside, here, oh, okay. We was running for our lives. You led them straight to us, and you let them take the druid too. Unbelievable! Oh, stop being a wimp and fight the buggers! One fight just ended. Now you're picking another. Relax, you daft bugger! Tell that to the dead at the gate. She I help you boys. fight. I'd be lying dead next to the goblins if you'd stalled any longer. My duty is to this camp. Oh, God forbid you risk your precious tail. But I shouldn't be surprised. Ain't known for courage.
Oh, right. Oh, no. Not going up there. You want me to take you both down? I will. Otherwise, just bloody knock it off. Enough! Squabbling is pointless. Exactly. The goblins have found us. At least we agree on that. More goblins could be that. on their way. Yeah. Oh. yeah. Forget the goblins. Come, let's good. interrogate the locals. One we might have leave. seen other Gith Yankee. Right, we got them. Alien promotion now. Good. Level three. Plus spell slots, you got spells. You got particularly domain. And I get Yankee friend. Group class features superiority dice plus four. Choices pending. Specialization available. Battlemaster the champion. Approach complex problems posed by combat with one distinctly effective solution. Yeah, hit those problems. You know, that's more me. Battlemaster paragons of tactical superiority combining combat maneuvers. Yeah, that sounds like her. She's smarter than me. And maneuvers. Disarming strike. Trip attack. And a fainting attack. See what's over here first. Actually, you know what? I'm not going to worry about being up here. I'm going to head down to the village, like our uh, if Yankee friend said. All right, Zev Law. Forgive that display. Aradin's a blowhard, but that's no cause for me to join him. I know. Thank you for your help out there. I'm Zevlaw. All right, Zevi. Yeah, you're take, taking the role, aren't you? I'm a stallion. Well met. I should warn you. Visitors are no longer welcome in this grove. Whatever your business, I'd see to it quickly. The druids are forcing everyone out. This attack will only strengthen their resolve. Why are they forcing there you out? several attacks by different monsters. The druids blame us outsiders for drawing them here. Nobody's welcome anymore. I don't think we've got some issues, these druids. To cut the grove off from the world outside. We can't stay, but we'll be slaughtered if we leave. We are no fighters. You did okay. This ritual, is there no way to convince the druids to stop it? I've tried. Korga, their new first druid, won't even see me. Oh, well, we'll though. have to have a word. I know it's not your business, but she owes you for saving this place. Perhaps you could persuade her for more time to prepare, if nothing else. There you go. Yeah, I'll see what I can do. Let's not forget why we're here. No point in wasting precious time on a lost cause. You know, you're really getting on my nerves. 
If we are forced to leave now, we won't make it to the city. You'll find the druids at the heart of the grove. Please, make them see sense before more lives are lost. You, Miss Elven Priestess, you're starting to get on my nerves. The Hollow. This is about your precious Borders Gate. I care about our lives, our futures. No, you just care about your stupid apprenticeship. Take that back, right now. Pels, we can't just leave. They're kin. I'll not gamble our lives, our futures, on people who are as good as dead. We must leave for Baldur's Gate at once. Can we all just take a moment, please? Is he some kind of friend of Shadow Art? Spells if we don't bloody use them. We should stay. These people aren't fighters. We can help. Good. Yell well like said, Alas. Fine too. You should all stay. That's right, Stanley. You do what I tell you. Good. You should all stay. A single blade could make all the difference. Got a plus two. Need a ten. Well, that didn't work. You. Did you get mouthy at them? Is that what happened? Roll again. There you are. Thank you. It's the right thing to do and you know it. She's right, Roland. We're better than this. I know we are. Fine, I'll stay too. As you At both last, he's got a throat slip by Goblin Blade. Thank got you, a little man. bit of a spine. Not much of one by the look of it, but he's got a little bit of one. We should have left by now. Oh, short yeah. up! Can I slap him? Instead, we're just sitting here, practically begging to be attacked. Stay I'll bloody attack you. Will that make you feel better? You're doing the right thing. The tieflings need help. Us? There's every chance we've doomed ourselves by helping these people. We will end up fodder for some goblin's blade, all because Leah insists on helping every wounded foe we see. Our best chance to make it to Baldur's Gate is on our own. This place is lost. Dude, if you're ever in a fight, just convince the enemy to hit you in the stomach, because you ain't got no guts, it won't hurt. Why are you so eager to reach the city anyway? You are looking at Laroican's newest apprentice. Yes, that Laroican. What Laroican? The greatest wizard in Baldur's Gate. Does he like cowards as apprentices? Is that it? A Baldurian. Is this Laroican of Rezim uh, Ramizas Tower? His name is known far and wide, I see. Few can match him in terms of raw power and talent. Until now, that is. In years to come, you will boast of this meeting, I can assure you. I doubt it somehow. We meet again in Baldur's Gate, my friend. I doubt I'll be boasting a meeting you somehow. This plaque. This grove is kept by Sylvanus's faithful. That might fill of this place. The stone door. I hope the goblins aren't smart enough Keep to poison their place. Well. Good to be back behind the walls, have to say. For as long as that lasts. Don't make me hurt you, boy. Too late! Looking at you is painful enough! Well, damn! Dallas? You're not afraid to tell it like it is, are you? Get up there and make sure you don't beat this kid up. I already told you I don't! How many have it. Dumb enough to ask. How stupid! I'm <laughs> only going to ask you one more time, boy. Hand over my locket. I don't have your ugly locket. I never seen it before. Hand it over, or I'll slap the teeth out of your head. You're threatening the child. Don't you dare lay your finger on that child. You threatening me? If I have to. Raise hand to that child, and you'll lose it. Your choice. No bonus. All right. Made it.
You don't understand. The kid stole my locket. He... Go oh, the hell's with this. These little devils get away with everything because of coddling bastards like you. Yeah, you're about to get slapped, you mate. you someday. I hope I get to see it. Maybe you will. But personally, I doubt it. <laughs> Nicely around. said, kid. I like this kid. <laughs> Hope the goblins are smart enough to poison their blades. Oh, there's that's stuff we can take, is it? Easy money. And there's it got on. We've known enough grief this ten day traveller. Don't be the cause of more. We're not! Actually I'm trying to help out, you bugger. What's with the brazier? Oh, we put it out. I don't want to put it out. Let's head back downstairs and see what's going on over here. Actually, before we do, let's head back up here and see what's going on with these three. You're an idiot. Thanks to you, that kid is my locket. My mum gave that to me on her deathbed. What makes you think he's got it? got nothing to say to you. What makes you think he's got it? Oh, there's another there. I did. If it ain't the fearless goblin slayer, that's you us. To be seen with me, I ain't exactly popular with this lot. Who cares? All you did was stand up for your crew. I Half respect that. Crew are full of holes. Now I'm gonna take the blame for leading the goblins here and losing track of the bloody druid. Where did the dog items come from? All the way from the ruins we were poking around in. Is that where you lost track of the druid you mentioned? Aye. His name's Halsin. And if he's still alive, he'll be cursing the day he laid eyes on me. We've got a contract to track down some relic, and he wanted in on the job. Eyes lit up when he heard about it. Ah, druids and the relics. Goblins gone when we return in tail. He's either digging latrines or boiling in a cook pot by now. You never look at that contract. Job's all yours, if you got a death wish. No, I'm There's just better than you. In Baldur's Gate, they'll pay goblins for a relic. Supposedly buried round these parts, but gold ain't any use if you're too cold to spend it. Tell me where to find the relic. It's called the Night Song. It's supposed to be hidden under the temple where the goblins jumped us. I'd give you the map and wish you a happy funeral, but my mate Brian kept hold of it like his own todger. Goblins made sure to the fat old chunk. All I've got's the contract. It'll show you where we turn back if you feel like dying. He kept holding it like his own todger. Why do you walk around holding your, holding your todger all day? There's words for people like you. Anyway, thanks. Don't thank me. I'll be well on my way to Baldur's Gate when you die. Actually, you'll probably have been there because I ain't got any, uh, any interest in dying right now. And we'll have a dog, right? They don't allow them in Baldur's Gate. Cats, though. Hey! A little orange cat. And a house with a little door so that it can come and go as it pleases. Sounds good. A fence to keep eavesdroppers <laughs> out. Don't mind me, I'm just passing through. No bother. We're just daydreaming anyhow. What about you? Big plans for when you get to the city? I didn't know I was going there. Plans just around the journey's ambitious enough as it is. Been on our side this far. No reason to think it'll run out now. Optimism, my friend. Try it out. <laughs> These two are charming. This is enough. We'll start in the outer city. Get a little business going. Your spiced tea is life changing, and I can bake up almond cakes twenty at a time. No I suppose we'll start in the outer city. Okay, Get so your spiced tea. There's nothing to do up here. Wooden bench. What will we do for work when we get to the city? Everything else will be stealing. I think I'd make a fine teacher or a baker. See what this one wants. Damn. Blood excites me. Um right. Thanks for fighting off those goblins. Yeah, sure. You need to replace any gear? Just ask. My selection's pretty slim. I had to leave most of my equipment in Elturel. Oh about replacing any gear. We might want to sell some stuff. Uh until Roland shows off his thunder wave. Depends. How many people 
We got silver necklaces. These souls, we don't need these short balls. This soul coin. Won't sell that. And actually, we don't need that. Don't need the leather armor. Don't need a studded shield. Oh, so you got to sell from one before switching to another. Uh, we'll get rid of that, because that will be the weapon's got. Gloves of power. Uh, I don't know if we can use them for something. Got half of water. With an action on it. Candles. Plates. A silver plate. We don't need it. Don't need cups. Vagabond claws. Don't be grumpy, Rona. We'll get to the city soon. I am not grumpy. Scowling your face would frighten a troll. <laughs> You're an idiot. What's that? Plastic bulb. Might need it at some point. Plates. Skulls. Milk cans. Tin cups. Uh, bottles. Knives. Lids, bugs. I don't know if we'll need the rope. I don't think we do. I think it's action. <laughs> I'm going to assume the dark mines we can't do anything with. Nope, oh, there. Here, have it. Tongs. Until Ronan shows off his thunder wave. Depends. How many people are dumb enough to ask? <laughs> True. Jog. Jog. Boon. Uh. Fork. Perfume lighter. More books. That ancient scroll. I don't know if we'll need that. I doubt it. Loot. Class action. I'd die if I met a rogue and reeking of Burnished place. necklace. You never get the smell out of my clothes. I'll have to uh, leather gloves. I don't know if anyone's going to need them. We're not going to sell them right now. Leather boots too. Teddy door ring, yeah we can sell that. Copper ring. Get rid of the cheap armour. And the robes. I don't know if they're using a shield. Goblin scimitar wasn't adding anything. Rimmed hat, you can have that. On its day, yep, we've got better weapons than these already. Wait, add to where's is that? Grumpy Roland. We'll get to the city soon. I am not grumpy. Scowl on your face would frighten a troll. <laughs> You're an oh, I was hoping that would just put it there. I guess not. It it would help if there was uh, a way to just get rid of junk. Get rid of, you know, stuff you're not going to keep. At least in uh, the Pathfinder games, I guess that's one thing they didn't include in this one, unfortunately. Not a big deal. Slave mind. Yeah, you can have that. What's that old floppy hat? You can have that. 
Why does a lot of this stuff? Should be feeling a lot lighter once we're done with this. How long until Roland shows off his thunder wave? You've asked that about a dozen times already. How many people are dumb enough to ask? <laughs> True. What's this ritual staff? What need it? Torch. Torch. Our friend's got light, so we don't need that. Sam. Uh, Trapped Sam toolkit. He should have that, not me. Revivify, yep. You know what? We'll get that. No, I don't. I don't want to donate them. Ah, I see what you have to do. So I screwed up the first time. Oh well, not to worry. We'll get that. And crossbow four to nine. Nope. Like crossbow five to twelve. We'll get that. Hunting short bow. Yes, we'll have that. Don't be grumpy, Roland. We'll get to the city soon. I am not grumpy. Scowl on your face and frighten a troll. <laughs> Arrow of Thunder or? Alright. And then I can sell the other stuff. Roll the protection from evil and good. I'll never remember to use it, so never mind. Get rid of that. We had a wizard, we might be able to learn from that, I'm not sure, but that works. Uh. Right, you. How long until Roland shows off his thunder wave? Depends. How many people are dumb Not enough useful to for me. <laughs> True. Sorry, baby, fine. There you go. Got rid of all the junk. That forge is only one by thread. He was Smith. Of sorts. Used to be a bread and butter tinsmith before Elderell fell into a furnace. These days, my talents are more eclectic. Learned a lot in my time in the hells. Hope to forget most of it. But die between you the road and me, and of there's nothing place. in all the realms like the utter power, power of infernal machinery. Alas, my offerings are far more humble these days. All right. Well, I'll leave then. Hells take me. What I wouldn't do for best tools. Wooden trunk. We can use that, can we? Now, let me go to you. Oh, hang on, I can go up now. I can get a promotion. Level 3. Specialization. The problem. 
really quite hard. That's definitely us. I am not grumpy. The scowl on your face would frighten a troll. <laughs> now, you get that. And you get that. What a day. We'll have a word with these folks, Stadion. Never admit it, but they take an arrow for the other. Also stab each other. Not sure what will come first. <laughs> Thanks for cutting in. There might have been more than words if you hadn't. Hey, that's easy done. No problem. Those goblins will rule the day they chose to tangle with this grove. Absolutely. You and I will do some good here. You I got it. Feel it. You got it. What a lovely, brave lady. I like her. How long until Roland shows off his thunder wave? Well, you stop asking that, you get to annoying. People are dumb enough to ask. Hello, Roland. My thunder wave will make quick work of any goblin. Just you wait. Will it? I'm less than convinced that the saying anyone who asks you to do it is stupid. That's not a strong recommendation from your own friends. Auntie Ethel. Ah, uh, is the talk of the camp. Thank goodness you came along when you. Oh. Interesting to see you strutting about in the sun. Ain't seen that before. And Auntie Ethel's seen her fair share. Uh, Still, what? you're looking a little pasty, love. I've just the thing to perk you up. Is it out? Well, let's see what she does. Why don't you let her go, Estanio? You take a sup at that and you'll feel right as rain, sweetie. Fair enough. You're gonna do it, Estadian, I'm telling you. Uh, this is an expertly made healing potion. Nicely done. Oh, stop with the sweet talk. Here, take the end of the bat, just in case. I'm sorry to go on about it. But are you all right? You're looking awful peaky. <laughs> I've been better. It's uh, it's difficult oh, to explain. I've seen it all. I once had a fella who'd been caught dabbling with a dryad. Sounds like Your fun. Wife was none too pleased and didn't that sounds less like fun. Boiling oil. Ooh. But worry not. I fixed him up, and depending on the lighting, he looks good as depending new. Depending on the lighting. Well. My point is, whatever ails you, I promise I've seen really? worse. Really? Mind player worms? She is not to know of the our ailment. Oh yes, she is. Only a gith healer may make us pure. You don't know that for sure. What's wrong? Oh, yeah, we'll be open. Yeah, I've got a mind flare parasite in my head. Count your adventure, Auntie Ethel nods along, her eyes wide. You poor pet! My heart goes out to you truly. I see no sign of a tentacle yet, but that could change in an instant. You need help. I know that. Serious help. Yes. I've never a potion or lotion here that could do it, but yes, I may have something at home. Let's hope that. Special chance. I've collected some interesting bits and bobs over the years. I bet you have. You'll have to stop by my house. Just at the edge of the forest. Let me mark it on your map. Oh, okay. I'll be heading back soon, so I can meet you there. Eh? Now, do you need anything? I have a few odds and ends for sale. No, nothing for now. Hey, bother, love. Come back any time. Sounds fair. See you at your house. Hmm. Doesn't taste half bad. Is that everything? Right, let's head up here. Goblins, druids, this grove is a death trap. Grab what you can and get out. That's my advice. Is it? Well, let's go in here. Yeah? 
You ain't gonna shoot me. Your hands are shaking. A little goblin gas. Put it down. You can't fight back. That's the point. <laughs> Get out of the way. She didn't kill your brother, Arca. You're better than this. Shoot before you lose your nerve, Tiefling. If you ever Ooh. hate to begin with. I like her. Yeah, let's uh, interrupt this. There's that in. I like that you're on board with this. Sent me a protector. You're gonna kill him too. You move. <laughs> yeah, no, shoot me. It should be easy, right? What in every hell <coughs> is wrong with you? Well, my boss here, he don't Damn like... Uh, well, why do you care if a goblin lives or dies? We don't like you taking on people. I mean, if you want to have a fair fight, sure. Not target practice, a person. Your soft heart will be the death of us. Can't say I understand that. I'm not sure I want to. It's all right, Arca. Let's go. Let me out, you... I ain't sure why you're protecting me. <laughs> Don't care, neither. It's too late to make friends walk me. <laughs> My tribe's coming. They're gonna burn this pretty place for the glory of the absolute oh. and hang you by your guts. Who is this absolute you fond of? Your god? Goddess. Oh. We're burning her name across the face of the world, we are. The yeah, well, absolute I wouldn't try it with us, love. Sky she is. The blessing in the storm and the storm itself. Absolute is gold from the sky. She is a blessing of an okay. Got my interest in the holy literature on you. My tribe can tell you everything there is to know. Absolute bless one of our own. Priestess Gut got a whole lab set up, cooks up potions that fix our lads, no matter how much of a beating they take. Probably not if they're dead. Stick your head back on if someone was to chop it off. Well, we'll have to try that, won't we? Mighty booyog. Bah. A clever goblin's like a trustworthy gig, a figment of the imagination. Well, that's certainly right to me. Yeah. Here, and I'll tell you where to find her. Deal? You already told me what I need to know. I'll find the princess myself. <laughs> Even if you did find my tribe, they'd set the wargs on you. You need me. Get me out of here, and I'll tell them what a good friend you are. Uh, we might come back later. You're gonna be sorry, every last one of you. We can't do anything with that, okay? Oh, you teeth are all boring. Even your cages are boring. <laughs> you know what? She's entertaining. We'll let her go. I'm running out of time, walk me. My family will be here soon. <clears throat> let me out. Deal. I'll yeah, get you out there. Can do it. My tribe ain't as friendly as I am. <laughs> I don't know anyone that ever used the word friendly for you, but and your and if we find a way to let you out, we will. Excuse me. Ill made to hear the martyr's cries takes in the ill and of, of the oppressed. When one to help the other dies, then by your master they are blessed. 
Jurgil or so it's often said once gave away his bony throne. For Kelimbor he tracked the dead. Make sure the dead souls do not roam. Kelimbor, Lord of the Dead, will take your hand when death arrives. Make sure souls are currently led to all their proper afterlives. <coughs> All right, Zoro. By Lord Ice Eyes, another one. My friends come to rip me open too. In Kresh Kalir, a formal greeting begins with a bow. Is this monster with you? Give him a glare. That's better. <laughs> Don't call my friend a monster. <laughs> On your knees, she wants it again. You go. You came in rude. Good lad. You saw another gift. Where? On the road to Baldur's Gate, N near the mountain pass. S saw us, for we saw it. Jammed its blade through Yul's belly. Straight to the other side. No twisting. Kin must have been in a hurry. <laughs> the map. Show me. Up. You can keep your innards. I'm not going to smash their doors open. Children, step, parry, strike, damn it! It's just not landing. Well, you're standing too far away for the start. Entrance technique, you having some trouble? Nothing but. Goblins in the wild, out for blood, and the druids in here looking to kick us out. Or worse. We need to be ready for a fight. But I'm useless with a sword. Yeah, I've noticed that. Didn't the joust faint with your sword, then kick it between the legs instead. Let's see then. <coughs> faint, kick, thrust. You really know what you're doing. He does actually, he's a bit sneaky. Road. Bet you'll put it to good use. Keep training. Oh, actually, yeah, one last thing. Don't shout out your moves like that. Spoils the surprise, oh, people. Yes, I'll bite my tongue when the time comes. Well, don't do that. That'll hurt and distract you. Keep training in time. You'll make short work of any goblins. Hopefully it's just the goblins we have to worry about. The druids are treating us like vermin. But yeah, they've got an attitude it. problem. Thank you. As the hell is inspired. The Blade of Frontiers. <laughs> what a thrill for the children. <laughs> They're tough kids. Smart, too. The future's in good hands. The children are their future, indeed. Received a battle axe, all right. The Blade of Frontiers. Oh, we've seen that. <laughs> Here we go. Hold. This is boring. We should train against real goblins. Yeah, I don't think you're ready for that. I mean, I like the optimism, but I don't think you're ready for that yet. All right, well. Go on. Give me a best shot. <laughs> Not bad. Again. Keep on working, Willie boy. I can't do it. Not You're a yet. child. You're not meant to be able to do it yet. You got to learn. I don't need you to be like me. You just have to buy enough time to run. Come on. I believe in you. You can do this. It's good advice, child. You do well to hmm. listen. You're on the right path, Umi. Go on now. Practice what you've learned. Well met. The Blade of Frontiers at your... The man's smile bends downward. 
and his thoughts become yours. You got worm in your head too. The blade of frontiers racing through the wastes of Avernus. Just ahead, a diabolical figure, red skin, single curled horn, blazes with flame, bloodied great axe hell. <sighs> Hell's great fires. You were on the ship. Yeah, just like you seemingly. Yeah, and we both carry parasites. Mm. Doomed to shed our skin and become a lithid, or so the stories go. Working we on not doing. Not any tentacles. Not yet, anyway. Could just be good luck. I'm not so. Your minds collide once more. Will chases the fiend ignited with rancor. She is an infernal war devil. A threat to the living. Evil incarnate. Shit! Mm. You saw her. Advocatus Diaboli. Yeah, I did. Advocatus Diaboli. A devil's advocate. A champion in the blood war between diabolical forces and demons. Who is she? Her name is Karlak. An archdevil soldier I swore on my good eye to kill. I tracked her through the hells to the Mind Flayer ship. But the damned Elithids infected me before I could end her. She's out there now. Preying on the innocent. I don't kill her. She'll leave behind nothing but a trail of corpses. Then, uh, I'm looking to kill this infection. I suggest we partner up. Just so you know, my first duty is Karlak. I'm oath bound to go after her. Yeah, it's not going to do much good if you become a I mind player, is it? This infection is bothersome. I accept your invitation. You'll need to make room if you want to partner up, though. Still, when the time comes, call for the blade. I won't be long to answer. Alright, go to my camp. A splendid wait, plan. Wait. We'll talk more there. Who, me? Oh. Uh. Right. Uh. Go for the heart. That's the way, kid. Burn them. Next time the goblins come, I'll be ready. There you are. These kids are braver than some of the adults around here. Don't linger. They may not have the competence yet, but they got the courage. He stares right past you, as if you're invisible. Or boring. You see nothing out of the ordinary. When you turn back, there's no trace of the child. Oh. Those children! How do we on how do we use these skills? <laughs> Easy. Oh, that's how you do it. Okay, I wish I'd known that from the start. Yeah, that didn't help. Let's roll again. One more time. Fifteen, and I've got. What is it? Three, five, seven. Oh, I only need an eight. There you go. I study and stun it. Well, gold, is that all you got? <sighs> Who's this Silphy? Oh, um, I... Hi. I don't have any money or anything to sell. My p partner does that. Uh, what's your side of the business? What? <laughs> I'm watching you. Alright, kid, as you say. Hold out your hand, mister. Let me show you something. Go nice on. trick. Take this ring. It's lucky. Is it? Nice sleight of hand. I must flourish, right? Uh, I never learned names or anything. 
Just the tricks. It's cool. Anyway, forget that. Take the ring. I want to show you how lucky it is. Fair enough. Let's do a reverse hammer slash. Got it. Weeping, bleeding hells. <laughs> okay, maybe you don't need extra luck, but since you're already holding the thing, call it heads or tails. Heads. Yeah, Heads it is. See? That's the kind of luck you get from one of my lucky rings. I've got more where that came from. Real cheat, too. Interested? Maybe. One coin toss doesn't prove anything, though. Okay, fair. Let's go again. Heads or tails? Call it. Tails. We got tails. There. Hmm. Happy? You really think you could fool me? I, uh, I don't know what you mean. Yeah. Come on, this is a Tinker's Trash Can, a clumsy one. Hey, that hurts. I'm running an honest... Uh, okay, what's a Tinker's Trash? When a scammer offers a target a magic object, uh -huh. then re uh, rigs a game to gain the target's trust and sell them trash. Huh. Interesting. And I promise, this isn't a Tinker's Trash scam. Hmm. Then what kind of con is it? Look, I swear to you, these rings are the real deal. I promise I'm not running a scam. Last chance. You want to look at my stuff or not? Here's your ring. Let's I trade. Hang on. Let's see what you got. That's what I got. Lauren's inspired. Red dye. You can change the colour of stuff. Okay. But none of that's. Oh, Ring of Infinite Wishes. It's roughly carved with nonsensical rune. I think this is fake. Yeah, we'll leave it by. Uh, we'll leave it be. Nothing caught your eye, huh? <laughs> yeah, it's nothing Don't but junk. For me to argue with that discerning eye of yours, sir. Anyway, see you again sometime. Take care. Yeah, it was Ciao. fun meeting a fellow soul. You realize your bag feels light. <laughs> you were just robbed. That's Darian, you should be better than that. Hey, you're back. Here to buy some stuff? You're taking something, something that doesn't belong to you. Hey. No, promise. I'm just a kid trying to make a living. Or was it your partner you know saw running off? Mole. She's my boss, I guess. Good at finding stuff. Her office is through the crack in the wall over there, if you can fit. Been playing this game longer than you when I tend yeah, to win. Me too. And if you want your stuff back, you gotta talk to her. <laughs> Go on. Mole's waiting. Fair enough. Still feet. You're the one who did it, aren't you, boy? Oh, hello again. Um I've been robbed. You're the guard. See anything suspicious? Me? Suspicious? I know your game and it's sloppy. Drop the act. It wasn't my idea. It was Moles. She... Um... I wasn't supposed to say her name. It's alright, your, anyway, your friend does it. anything else, you can't make me. Even if you murder me. Oh, that's not my plan. You can say anything else. She sprints away. All right, kid. Looks like we're off to find this mall, aren't we? Something over there. 
Yes, it is. It's a malt hole. Can't use this right now. Oh. Are we too big for that? Alright, well, I don't know what we've lost. We've lost something. It's only from the Let pack. My daughter go right now. Oh god, what's this? Hell spawn, and you will wait for Corgus judgment. Now get back! Oh, let me through, Ragrasham, or I'll rip your damn throat out! <gasps> okay! <coughs> Hello, bear! We could help each other, fight the goblins together. Instead, these fools are trying to chase <coughs> us away. We'll see what we can do. Oh, God. Try grease and palms. These things over. We need to get Arabella out now. You heard the guards. They're waiting on Corker to give word. I'd sooner trek through the nine hells than trust that snake. Ugh. Oh, what happened? Where are the druids holding your daughter? Arabella tried to steal their idol. Druids lost their damn minds about it. Yeah, they maybe shouldn't have done that. Precious ritual. Oh, it's all my fault. I told her I wished the wretched thing would just disappear. Or better yet, explode. Oops. Now Arabella's being judged by a bunch of druids who hate us. Yeah, you, you kind of screwed that one up. She was caught. Foolish child. Let them judge her. You know, you sometimes get on my nerves, my friend. Just a child, the druids are overacting, I'll talk Thank to you. them. They won't give us the time of day. Hurry! I'm at the end of my tether as is. Can't take this waiting. Uh, let's have a you word with them. Terrified. Also, what about you? Lives are at stake, and the cowards only care about their bloody rituals. Yeah, that sounds like druids. Alright, let's go have a word with these folks. Come, Magrin, give him a chance. You, get back. It won't for me, it'd be overrun by goblins by now. I'll go where, please. Get back. Force my hand, and I'll show you its claws. A moment. Yeah, you don't want to try that. What? Oh, I understand. You. Apparently, Korga wants to see you. Go ahead. Do they? Your welcome can be easily withdrawn, outsider. Respect our grove, or face our claws. You don't want to pull that number with me, I'm telling you now. Get your ass in line. My welcome can be withdrawn as well. Alright, Volo, who are you? Ah, my good friend! You were at the gates just now, no? When the goblins came? You saw them up close? A few questions, if you please. There's no overstating my interest. Well, I ask you questions. Glory. Now then. How would you describe that particular batch of goblins? What the hell? Size, nature, distinguishing qualities. You search your mind. Successfully recalling various details of goblin behavior. Let's give it the exact description. Goblins were of a rare jam colored hue and wielded magic blowguns. A myth weaver. This man has no respect for truth. And the dragon they had marching in the rear was. There was no bloody dragon. Silver variety. There wasn't a dragon. Witnesses failed to notice the obvious. Is he, a, is he a reporter? He's a reporter, isn't he? Last question. Then you'll be quite free. Did the attackers rally to the absolute when they fell upon the gates? Yeah, they called out the name like a war cry. Oh, oh, curious. Oh, curious indeed. I've interrogated one. 
a captive in this very camp. I know. She reports they've abandoned their god Maglaviet in favor of someone called the Absolute. I've met her. The scandal. Hold no, your tongue. I'm Stop being so judgmental. As we speak. I always knew my studies in Gukliak would come to some use. Wait, about our conversation earlier, why the dragon? My friend, every story benefits from a dragon. Until we meet again. Each chapter in this book describes the cultural origins of different mythological beasts. Chapter 5. Miniature giant space hamster. Oh, no, enough. Enough, that sounds like nonsense. Akla? And you, Garrick? Defende nos ab imine tebus aquilebre o tuo. Eh, I might not be able to talk to these folks, they're too busy with their ritual, aren't they? I don't think they'd notice if a, if a horde of goblins did swarm the camp. What about you, Elwyn? Yeah, there's literally no point in talking to any of these folks. Right, uh But try and steal the ultimate, I don't think that's a good move. Tough it. You're a bear. Was not good. Come on, roll again. There you go. Now we can go up there if we want. But do we actually want to? That's the question. Actually, we can't go up there. There's no way up there. All right, so. No one around there. Well, there's this door over here. I assume it's a door. I'm sorry. Forest rose with claw and tooth to tear the darkness from its roots. It did. The mural depicts druid and beast fighting together <laughs> to drive monsters from their land. It looks like they were victorious, and yet the monsters have returned. Be I think we'll be exploring this grove next time. In the meantime, hit the like, comment and subscribe if you want the channel to grow. And I'll see you down. Bye now.